Hey friends, happy Wednesday. How's everyone today? Hope y'all are having a great day. We are on um, day 30 in Selah. Thank you for taking this time to pause and reflect. Obviously, we have to reflect on the words of the Lord. Uh, first of all, you have to believe that he is a rewarder of those that diligently seek him. You have to believe that he is. You have to believe that his words are absolute truth. If you don't, then don't watch this. But if you do, if you really believe that his word will accomplish something in your heart today that's fruitful, then join me. Okay, so we are on day 30. Day 30. There's more where that came from. There's more where that came from. When Jesus is the source, right? There's always more. There's always more where that came from. But even if I am being poured out like a drink offering on the sacrifice and service of your faith, I am glad and rejoice with all of you. Philippians 2.17. Don't you love that? Don't you love that? Ministry sometimes can be a pouring out, uh, just like uh, lemonade. So go ahead and pour it out down to the, the last drop. Give all you got. When you know the source, you know where you can go to be filled up. Be a walking, talking lemonade stand to the dry and parched. Squeeze out all distractions and take action. You may be the only refreshment someone encounters today. Have you ever had lemonade stands when you were little or have you ever walked to a lemonade stand? It's in the middle of summer, right? So sometimes people are in the middle of the heat. They're in the heat of the battle and they need what you have. It could be a simple, simple smile. It could be a word of encouragement. It could just be an empathetic, understanding ear just for that moment, uh, just for that moment that you encounter someone. It could even be, I don't know, in the grocery store, but just be sensitive to the Holy Spirit. Don't do something if you don't feel led to do it. But if you feel led to do it, by all means, look for those opportunities. Pour out love on the rude. Pour out thanksgiving when you are tempted to have a bad attitude. Pour out premium priced patience when you want to be mean and snappy. Amen. Pour out help to the ungrateful. The Holy Spirit will flow with sweet power in the hour that you need him. When you are weary and emptied, you can come to him again for rest. He is faithful to fill you to the overflow. You never know. Your water may help grow a seed someone else has planted. Amen. If you have gallons of joy, you must live near the river. Selah. So praise God. Know that we love because he first loved us. So whatever unique relationship you have with the Lord, it's you're here for a purpose. We are all not cookie cutters. Your ministry may look totally different. I hope it does. But whatever he has implanted in your heart, give it out today. And I pray y'all have a blessed day. Bye.